This morning, some of the world's most influential social media platforms responding to backlash from users, influencers, and even celebrities. Facebook has always been about friendships and connections. Instagram lets you see your friends' pictures. But now those experiences may be changing. Facebook is testing a major redesign, showing posts based on your interests and an algorithm instead of posts that connect you with your inner circle. And Instagram drawing the most attention. The app originally known for artful photos now focusing on video. Introducing a full screen feed where photos and videos take up the whole screen. And including recommendations of other users' posts in your feed as well as friends and contacts. Now, powerful users are pushing back. While people love video, they kind of say there's like a time and a place for that. Some point out the app now feels more like TikTok, the trend-setting platform popular with younger users. Kylie Jenner and Kim Kardashian, who holds some of the most popular Instagram accounts, both reposted this meme to their hundreds of millions of followers, imploring the platform to stop trying to be TikTok. User reaction was so strong it forced Masseri to respond. There's a lot going on on Instagram right now. We're experimenting with a number of different changes to the app. And so we're hearing a lot of concerns from all of you. I need to be honest. I do believe that more and more of Instagram is going to become video over time. An Instagram spokesperson stressing to NBC News, the changes are, quote, just a test, and that Instagram is still where your friends and interests meet to push culture forward. But that may be part of the problem. In a lot of ways, Instagram has made the same mistake that Facebook made, which is trying to be too many things to too many people and losing focus along the way. TikTok was the most downloaded app in 2021 and through the first quarter of 2022, a growth largely fueled by Gen Z users born in the late 1990s and early 2000s. TikTok is so attention-grabbing that after too much scrolling, it actually encourages some users to take a break. Meta, formerly known as Facebook, seems to want to be that captivating. But it faces a dilemma. Stay relevant or stay true to what it was? We've heard people say, I want Instagram to be Instagram. I want Facebook to be Facebook. Now, something to note here, as Facebook rolls out its changes later this year, the company says it will provide a way for users to still see all those updates from family and friends chronologically in a separate feed. Now, Facebook has not responded to our request for comment. I think anybody who has Instagram has seen, like, suddenly your feed went to the people you know and love, yeah. to, like, a ton of other people. That you don't know, you and you're this, constantly, you, like you might like that, exiting it out. So people are complaining about what's going on, people who love the old Instagram. Yes. Is there any way that Instagram's going to say, okay, Okay, maybe you were right. Let's go back to the way it was. You know, so Adam Masseri comes out, the head of Instagram, comes yeah. out and says, you know, we're going to respect the heritage of Instagram, which was photos, <laughs> right? He <laughs> uses the word heritage. Yeah. You know, but but you have to keep in mind, right, that these are companies and they yeah. are about growth. Yeah. And they have seen this other company, TikTok, come up with this entirely yeah. different model. Yeah. And their model is teaching us to perform for strangers is oh, really what TikTok is about. Yeah. And it seems like that is where these others are going to go. And that's going to transform a whole generation's worth of behavior. Here's what I, makes yeah, me yeah. notice or nervous. I find myself at night before I go to bed, I'll say, let me just see what's going on. Right. Yeah. I'll keep scrolling, yeah, it's the especially most on Reels. Feature. It's the most addictive so feature. I'll just admit right here, uh, you know, uh, I am one of those TikTok users who gets so sucked in that I literally get a video that says, you should go to bed now. From what? TikTok, it says, stop. Who do You've they give that long. to? How long that, I'm in the to top, on. whatever that is, oh, 1% or whatever oh that goodness. is. And that is just how compulsive it is. And that's why, of course, Instagram and Facebook are looking at this and say, we need to be just that captivating. Jake, wow. the first step is admitting you have a problem. That's <laughs> what I do. That's <laughs> what I do. I have it's for your job. You're doing it for your yeah, job. Yeah, 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 don't right. forget, it's for your job. job. All right, Jake, thank you. Hey, thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Find your favorite recipes, celebrity interviews, uplifting stories, shop our favorite deals, and so much more with the Today app. Download it now.